This video will introduce you to offline provisioning and publishing for Kramer Control. Kramer Control can be installed on sites where there is no WAN access. In these instances, you can provision the brain offline and keep the system off WAN from the start of the installation. Use the builder to complete the programming process. Once you're finished, make sure you publish your changes to the cloud. Click the UI tab and then select Laptop. You will see a notification at the bottom of the screen telling you that the publish file is being processed. The Cloud Publish will generate a publishing file that is used online or offline. The contents of this cloud publishing include GUI imaging, controlled devices, the local IP addresses of controlled equipment, and project location settings. The control itself does not live in the cloud. If you have customers with security concerns regarding the cloud, you can inform them that the control is local and the programming is stored within the cloud. By removing WAN from the brain, our remote access will never connect. When the publishing process is complete, close the builder and return to the manager. You will see an option for Express Mode, where you can control and provision the space without signing in. If you choose to modify Express Mode, click Save. You will need to refresh the manager so the manager will see the publishing file that was generated. The next step is to select the space and then expand the menu in the center window by clicking the three vertical dots in the upper right-hand corner of the center window to show the Request Provisioning File option. Selecting this option will launch a new pop-up window where you can fill in some information to generate the file. Click Continue when asked if you want to request a provisioning file. The pop-up is going to ask for the Brain ID. The Brain ID can be found by going to the Brain Info webpage of the Brain and copying the Brain ID that appears in the Info section. After pasting the Brain ID onto the line in the pop-up window, click Continue. A warning message will come up saying the brain will be provisioned. Click the Request button. Next, we will select the File Management icon from the vertical toolbar on the left side of the center window. If you move your mouse over the icon, the File Management label will appear so you know you have the correct one. File Management is where we store publishing and provision files for the brain. If you do not see your newly generated provisioning file, just wait a few moments for it to appear. Once the file appears, check the box next to the file to select it and click the Download button that appears at the bottom of the center window. The file will be downloaded to the Downloads folder of your machine. The final step is to load the provisioning file to the Brain via the Brain Information webpage. Go to the Brain Info webpage and select the Provisioning tab. Next, expand the offline provisioning option and then click on the light gray area to select the file from your machine. Locate the correct file and wait a few moments for your provision process to complete. That's it! Now you know how to install Kramer Control even when you have no WAN access. Thanks for taking the time to learn about offline provision and publish.